Yeah, hello everybody. The stock market is down for the month of January, roughly 5%. And uh, it's a little rough. Wall Street, uh, S&P, Dow Jones. The start in the year 2014 is not so smooth than you would have thought after a great year last year with a run up of uh, roughly around about 30%. And what does it tell you? Like it's difficult to pump in for five years fresh money into the market. What the Fed did, Ben Bernanke pumping fresh printing money and printing money endlessly money does not help um, the economy overall because you have a lot of companies uh, that receive the money like the banks. They are hoarding uh, Apple, Cisco. Facebook, they have billions on their cash accounts and they don't invest because they are careful. So the money is not really um, going in the right direction. So the Fed can do uh, lower the interest rates and pump a lot of money into the economy, but it doesn't solve the real problems. The problems are that a lot of jobs get um, are going out of the United States. They are going to South America. They are going to China, to Asia. Companies uh, uh, reduce their production, their factory staff inside the US and going more outside. Another problem is robotics are taking over a lot, machines, computers. Maybe in some days you will not have a cab driver anymore and there may be a robotic that will drive you to your, to, uh, to the, to your destination. And um, when you go to the pool, there will be not anymore somebody at the cash register. You have also self-checkouts in supermarkets. Computers, machines are taking over humans. So there are a lot of problems. Unemployment rate is pretty, still pretty high. So the economy uh, has uh, is struggling. But overall, the stock market, what I said before, is going up average 10% a year. So you have now... A correction it can it can be worse. You cannot assume that the five percent a month will end up uh, twelve times sixty percent down. That's very unrealistic. But we are now in a correction phase. Maybe the year is bad overall. It can be nobody knows. It's just guessing. No, but it can tell you exactly what will happen. These are just. Uh, yeah. There are so many people out there that tell you exactly what the stock market will do over the year. But it's all. It's all like, it's not, it's, those people know nothing. They do not know anything. It's just guessing and it's not worth actually to listen to them because they don't know it. It's just uh, looking into a crystal ball and telling you bullshit. So what do you do? If you buy constantly stocks, like let's say you buy cons every month, keep on doing it. The stocks are down. It's a good thing. You get them cheaper. Keep doing that uh, constantly saving into stocks. If uh, if you have if you have a nice cash holding, wait and see if the stock market corrects further. Just keep go dig into the market. If there's a crash, go in brutally. Invest a lot. If there's a crash, invest a lot. But I wouldn't be worried. I wouldn't panic. I wouldn't sell now. It's just wait and see and take it easy. And the problems will be solved. The money printing will slow down. Uh, Janet Yellen, the new uh, uh, Fed chief, uh, she uh, she has to slow down the printing machines, and that process when the economy, the system gets less cash, cheap money. When, when that process slows down, it's like a drug addict. You take away the drugs. That is a, is a tough. It's a struggle for a body. It's not easy, and that's what you see now in the economy. And this process is uh, 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 not easy to get over it. It can take, uh, uh, it can be a rough year. 2014 can be a rough year because of that change in policy. Five years money printing, endlessly money printing, uh, cheap loans, cheap credit is over. The Fed decided this uh, will stop that process. And uh, that's what we have now. Um, stock market is correct in a correction modus, and uh, but, but don't be worried. Long term, it's good. Uh, the the uh, the, uh, the um, economy gets long term better. People live longer. They live healthier. They, uh, we have more knowledge, more innovation, and overall, uh, over the decades, life life will be much easier. And uh, 
just think 100 years back how people lived back then, how the life expectation was and what kind of luxuries you have today, it's much easier. So long term, very cool, short term, difficult, don't worry. If you uh, if you steady say if you steadily buying stocks keep on doing that stocks go down it's good for you if you are holding cash maybe wait a little bit and then dig into in in maybe in several steps makes it easier you you cost average out the, the price and uh, yeah if there's a crash I would add, I would add a lot to your stocks if 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 there's a crash and you have the liquidity just dig into and, and increase your holdings. Okay, that's all for today. Bye.